Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video based on how I get ready for my videos so it's going to be my setup and my makeup and you know just how I prep myself to get ready for my videos so with further ado let's get started I hope you guys enjoy and let me have a conversation with y'all welcome my newbies my new supporters I want y'all to know that y'all are so welcome and I love y'all and I really appreciate y'all for my day ones. I love y'all so, 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 so very much. Words can't explain and I can't say so, 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 so very much so many times like how much I really love y'all. I really hope that y'all enjoy yourself. Warning, I'm crazy. Like I'm goofy. I'm a goofball, you know, so you just not, you never know what I'm a doing my videos because I surprise myself sometimes like couple you know okay okay y'all I did my eyebrows off camera I know I'm looking like a naked mother right right now but hold on we'll come into yourself okay so what I did I went in with this the NYX brown coffee I'm, I'm so NYX 821 brown cafe um in this color and that's what I do with my eyebrows and then I concealed it with the LA girl pro concealer and the shade from the ones I use and I purchased this um little brush that I did for my eyebrows I purchased this off of Amazon it don't have a name or nothing like that and then I got this brush that came in a set from some brushes that I bought off the wish list and that's what I did with my eyebrows so next what I do after I do my eyebrows I prime my face and I'm going to be going in with this Mature Base um, Transforming Smoothie Primer. You can see it. But I purchased this off the wish list. <clears throat> and I just take the back of my fingernails. go in with my foundation and I use wet and wild photo focus foundation and cocoa come on baby you need to 
focus on my product right there. And I just focus on my face. The focus on my face. Stop playing with me. Okay. And I just get my little stuff and I just swipe it down on my face. Swipe it. Uh, swipe it. Close it up and I sit it to the side because I might have to go in some more for my um <clears throat> if my blemishes and stuff not covered up and then I just beat beat beat. to be going in with is this concealer it's um y'all I purchased this uh, let me see let me one time and they're called is skin concealer per dealer per dealer I don't know y'all but I'm gonna be using the one in um toffee 14 toffee y'all I'm sorry my camera had one day but I'm gonna be using that concealer in the shade 14 toffee this is how it looks. This is how it looks if you guys can, uh, if you guys are familiar with this kind. This is what I'm going to be using in the shade 14 Toffee. Okay, so first thing first, I go in with that LA Girl Pro Concealer High Definition and Warm Honey. And I put it in all of my highlights. This shade is actually a tad bit darker. I'm gonna 
gonna go back in with my beauty blender and just beat it. I'm going to be going in with this um, Pro Bronzer Natural um, with Zero Up for um, this Pro Concealer Light Absolute. Absolute New York. And I'm just going to be bronzing the places that I want to See, I told y'all my face wasn't lighter than my, um, my neck. is the same. Now I'm going I'm gonna be using this brush from um best best stops best soaps. I got this as well off of Amazon on the wish list. <laughs> I'm just being honest with you. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna use this one. And this is another brush from Another brush from an off brand little thing. This will be my first time using this, y'all. Because I normally use this uh bling from um the wish list for brown contour stick, but this will be my first time using this. So I'm just trying something out. I let this sit for a tad bitty belly. Now 
I like that set. And while letting that sit, I'm gonna put a little bit on my eyelashes. I mean my eye, my upper eyelid as well. And while that's sitting, I'm going to go in with this off-brand. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all know I'm not ready to say. But I'm gonna go in with this off-brand eyeshadow palette from Wishlist. And it have a lot of nice colors in there. Today I'm going for a more natural, you know, a more natural look. So I'm going to be using mostly like the browns and the nudes on my eyelid. And the brush that I love to use is this off-brand brush right here. And the first color that I'm going to go in with is this little light color right here. And I'm gonna build that up on my eye. So the reason why I put that, oh my hand got a cramp. The reason why I put that light color on the base of my eyes is because the next color that I want to put over it, I want it to, you know, pop out more. And so now I'm going to go in with this dark brown color right here. And I'm going to do the same thing with that. it to pop a little more like I don't want it to be like unnoticeable I want it to look like I have on me my eyeshadow so I'm going to go in with like a darker like a darker brown and that will be, you know matter of fact I'm going to go in with this little grayish looking black color right here And I'm just gonna put a very little of that on the outside. Just like that. Just a little bit. just like that babies and once I'm done with that my makeup has baked enough I'm going to wipe this off my face and I just got this little brush right here I hope that it do justice more so like bending like blending it in than uh dusting it off
set on hot lips. Okay, y'all, so I do a very natural, not dramatic type of makeup look. So next thing I go in is my blushy washy dashy. My blushy washy dashy. My blushy washy dashy. And I got this from the dollar store. Y'all, I don't use expensive makeup. My homegirl had got me some uh, MAC, but it don't look good on me, so I don't use it. But I'm gonna go in with this shade. I'm gonna be missing these two. Russell, I'm doing my video. What is it? What is it? Okay, y'all. I'm trying to make sure that my stuff is looking good. Okay, y'all. So, next thing I'm going to go in with my blush. Like I said, I'm going to be using this shade and this shade. And I take this little uh, brush right here. Go like this. I go just like that. And I, I smile. Okay, so after that, I get to my, after that, I get my eyelashes and put my eyelashes on. I'm going to be putting these on. And they is the Iconic Collection 3D Angle and Volume Lightweight um, Chick Icon Eyelashes. Drama from Maybelline, New York. 
I use this to just because you know after you put the concealer and stuff on like that like your eyelashes like you can't see them so I just do this so that I can find where I'm putting my eyelashes on at I just put a little you know just to um, find them make them back black and then I think that I'm gonna add a wing but I'm not sure yet so I'm gonna put my lashes on And that's his style. But y'all, after that, okay. So after I do that, put my lashes on after struggling for so long. <sighs> okay, after struggling for so long. I put my lashes on. Y'all, when I be having these eye breaks up in these videos, I really be supposed to cut it out. But I leave it up in there because I be wanting y'all to know the real me. Like, I'm I'm really crazy. Like, throw it off completely. <laughs> okay, y'all, so after that, I, um, and I love y'all because y'all are crazy too. Y'all like this stuff. That's why we best friends. That's why we like this. And if y'all ever try to leave me, I'll be having I'm not about to do this with y'all. I'm not about to do this no more. Do not go. Okay, I'm sorry. But after that, make sure that the glue is dry. I go in with a very darky walkie parky. Okay, I spray my face. I really don't want to spray it, but Okay, y'all. After the reason why I go in, come on, stop. The reason why I go in, so y'all can see that I'm really not. You know, my camera be HOing me, but I go in with the BR Dewy Setting Spray, Lunum Lunumish, and Set. Y'all, I just picked this up out the um, ATV, out the beauty all because I needed some setting spray. I don't think I like it like that. My favorite setting spray that I have ran across yet was this LA Girl Pro Setting High Definition Setting Spray Long Lash and Matic Finish. Uh, this, so I'm gonna go try to find me some more of this. I like it. I like this better than this. Okay, so once I have done that and I spray my face, I go in with highlighter. But I don't use highlighter. I use eyeshadow for my highlight. But I use this right here. Get over here. This gold shade right here. It's really a like an eyeshadow, like a shining eyeshadow. 
I use that and I just take my finger and I rub it across. And I just pat it above like where the highlighter is supposed to go. I don't put that much, I don't get crazy. And after that is done, I still got some. I'm gonna put this to use. Okay, so after that, I go in with a very, very dark eyeshadow pencil. Well, uh, eye pencil. I had this for so long, the name of it went off, but it say Ruby Kisses. So I guess this is a lip liner, but I use it as under my eyes to make my eyes more defined. It brings out the almond shape of my eyes. Then after that, I go in with my mascara again, the Maybelline New York Push Up Drum. This really not the um Okay. This really not how this is really not the finished look of it. The reason why I keep putting that powder right there because it brings the, the right color back because it be bleaching me out. But this is not the finished look of this. I've been having this for about three years. It's really dried up and I just be using it because I haven't found this nowhere else and I really love this of the pencil. Like, not the pencil, but the brush. It really um, comes through your eyelashes. So after I do that, what is next? Oh, my lips. I'm going to... Okay, so after I do that, I go back in with this NYX 821 Brown Cafe uh, pencil and I uh, I do my lips so let me take any stop, stop looking clean with me so I'm gonna take any um excess makeup off my lips but I'm going to miss the highlight that I put right there. I'm going to get some.
after that. I'll clean up as I go. Okay, so. After I I go in with my wet and wild mega lip lip gloss brilliant and the, this is 55 this is 556b sun glaze A Jack ASS. And what I do is get this and I just dab it on there like this. Then I go back in. Okay guys, so I done my makeup right. So now I'm about to show you guys my setup because I'm about to get ready to film a video for you guys. So try on how. So now I'm about to show you guys my setup next. So what I first do when I 
prep myself for my videos. I um get my my clothes ready. Like this outfit is about to be reacting to the dresses that my grandma um gave me. She's about sixty eight years old. And these, this is my setup. I have a light shining on the side of me. My ring light that's pointing at me. Y'all don't know that this be all behind the camera. And then I have another light like pointing directly at me. Okay, y'all. So this be the setup right here. Y'all see? This is not supposed to be right here. It's supposed to be over there with all the rest of us. So this be the setup right here. But I unplugged the fish tanks. See how much noise that thing makes. But yeah, this is it. Flesh. So yeah, this is my setup behind the crystal inky winky stinky dinky winky kinky dinky naked neck and stuff like that. But this be my setup behind all of my stuff right here. If y'all hear noise, that's my baby sister cooking. So yeah. And she also did my hair. So if y'all in the Houston area and if y'all want some hang time, cause I got that hang time. <laughs> if y'all want this, let me know. Email me and I'll let y'all know her prices. the Houston -ish area though, age town and don't try to get y'all hair done just to meet me because I probably don't even be there when y'all get it done. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm gonna be there because y'all know I'm lame and I need some friends. But yeah, yeah. This is my hair. I love y'all so 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 very much. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Kisses. Mm -hmm. Scream.